All right, good morning. Kurt here with Teach Mom How. Today I am responding to a question on uh, our channel from Spirit Walker where he watched the video on how to auto reply on an iPhone using a, a hack with the do not disturb settings. By the way, everybody thinks this feature is gone with the new iOS 13. It is not gone. It is still there. Watch the updated video that's in the in the description as well. Okay. So this, uh, this is the question. Spirit Walker said, nice trick. By the way, in this video, if you haven't watched it, you can go to the description and watch the original video. I show you how to set your phone to auto reply to people using a hack called do not disturb while driving. And he says, nice trick, but I'm looking for a way to automatically send a text reply to only someone specific whenever they text me and not to everyone across a time span. I'm still trying to figure out how to do this. In other words, he wants one specific message to be sent to one specific person every time they text them. Unfortunately, there is not a simple way or even a way I know of. Um, there may be ways using third party software and apps and things like that, um, which is probably more trouble and more money than it's worth. But here's two hacks that I think will help somewhat solve this question or this this problem okay okay so first off as you may or may not know they no longer call it do not disturb well they do but they have it grouped into a folder called focus so go to settings go to focus and then go to do not disturb driving all right so the original video showed us how to use this so go back and watch that if you want to know how to auto respond but this particular subscriber is asking, how can I auto respond to just one person? Well, if you click on auto reply, all contacts, you'll see who you've chosen to auto reply to. No one, recents, these are people you've uh, responded to in the last days. They'll re receive an auto reply when this feature is turned on. Your favorites and all contacts. The original video, I showed you how to use all contacts, and then anyone in your contact gets this auto reply if you put this on do not disturb while driving. So if you want to send an auto reply to just one specific person, the closest thing I can come up with to doing this is to use favorites. Okay. Favorites will receive an auto reply when this focus is turned on. So you would, you have to put this person as your favorite and you have to put only this person as your favorite not multiple people, if you only want this person to receive it. That's the only way I can think of. By doing that, by making one person a favorite and only one person a favorite, turning on favorites and turning on auto reply while driving or do not disturb while driving will send a custom message, whatever one you choose to put here, to just that one person. Okay, so I'm going to show you real quick how to make a person your favorites in case you want to do this. But be aware this will only work when you are either truly driving or you turn on that you're driving, okay? Okay, so to add people to your favorites, you need to go into your phone and down at the bottom, there's a star for favorites and you'll see all the people you have in your favorites. You can edit this list by clicking, clicking edit and deleting anyone you want to delete from this list. I'm gonna go ahead and delete everybody from it for right now. Okay, and then if I want to use this feature to auto respond to just one person, I would click the add button and choose the one person that I want to auto respond to. And now they're in my favorites. Now if I go back over to my settings, to settings, okay. I go back over to my settings, focus, driving, and I choose my auto reply settings to just favorites, whatever custom message I put in here, whatever I want to say to that one person while driving will auto reply to this person if I turn on driving. Okay. So it's only going to do that when I turn on driving, unfortunately. One other possible solution, it won't be an auto reply, but to just have this message ready to go. This message you want to send to this one person ready to go, basically like copying and pasting, 
so you can do it with like one or two clicks would be to use the text replacement feature in settings so go into settings I'll show you how to do this real quick go into settings this is cool to know anyways go to general and we're looking for keyboard whoops keyboard right here and text replacement okay these are where you can type a word or type a number and it will auto post a, a text, a paragraph, multiple paragraphs, whatever you have prepared. So I use this all the time in business when I have messages I use all over and over. So let's make one click plus the phrase is whatever you want to say. So type out whatever it is you want to say to this one person. Okay, whatever it is you want to say, type that whole thing out. And then the shortcut is the code that you will type to auto paste this in to there. Okay, I'm just going to call this reply. Okay, so let's not caps it because that's hard. Reply, whoops, sorry. I'll just call this reply one. All right, save it. Now, when I'm sending a message, if this person, for example, if this person texts me, I would simply type in reply one, and you'll see it auto pops up this don't bother me text. Click that and send it. All right. That is one way you can't, it won't auto reply, but you wouldn't have to type out that same message every time. You can have it just saved in your phone as what's called a text replacement and send that out. So I hope this helped you. And if you have any other questions, please subscribe to my channel, Teach Mom How, and post your comments and questions. And I'll try my best to make a video answering your questions. Have a great day. Thanks.